Virgo. Hey Virgo, welcome back to my channel. And this is the week ahead reading for the sign of Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, or wherever you have a heavy Virgo placement. If you're new to my channel, hello. I pray before each and every one of my readings so that way my energy is protected, your energy is protected as well. If you're returning, thank you so much for returning and trusting me with your energy. I greatly appreciate it. Wow, we have so much has gone unsaid. So this is a really interesting energy that's coming through with this card, okay? Because this masculine feels guilty about something. Or maybe you found something out about them that you shouldn't know. This is definitely a masculine who you are in communication with at this time, or there's some form of information exchange happening within your connection. But there's a lot that they're not saying to you. It's like they want to communicate, but they're not. That, that energy is coming through clearly. So this could manifest in them being really careful about what they share with you at this time. There's also something here about their tone of voice or the way that they say things that maybe makes you wonder if there's more to them that you can't really tell. But what's coming through clearly is that this is someone who's attempting to be very casual about your connection. You both know that there's chemistry, but this is someone who's holding back on moving your connection forward at this time. But it doesn't make sense to you. And honestly, the energy is interesting because it doesn't make sense to them as well. So your person's energy is coming through a little scramble, to be honest. So maybe this is just a deeper look into their mental process. Maybe their thoughts are kind of all over the place. Maybe they don't know what they're actually feeling or they can't really identify the emotions that are arising at this time. Because there's this energy of like back and forth, up and down, kind of like an emotional roller coaster. This is someone who enjoys your company, enjoys talking to you or just being in your energy, but for some reason they continuously hold back when it comes to you. But I'm picking up that this is personal. It's almost as if this person has to like pep talk themselves when coming in contact with you because they don't want to reveal much at this time. You could feel like this masculine is also spoon feeding you in the way that they communicate or in the way that they engage you. This could be them not wanting to reveal something about themselves personally or just about how they feel for you. But something about this energy does feel very, very restrictive, but in a really uncomfortable way. It's like they're going against what feels natural to them. And they don't really understand why, because they're only doing this with you. That comes through clearly, okay? So I'm picking up on a Divine Feminine that may be very, very frustrated with this masculine. There could be a lot of unanswered questions or they could just leave a lot of things open-ended. So much so that it makes you feel as if they're playing some type of game with you. But I'm getting it's much deeper than that. There's definitely something going on here behind the scenes. And if they were to be 100% honest with you, they don't want you to find out how they really feel about you. But I get the impression that you already know. Or you can pick up on their vibes at this time and you know that they're holding back for a much deeper reason. And there's, there's something here sticking out, something here being highlighted about the things you say to them, particularly the things you say that they don't necessarily respond to. So let's say if you ask them a really important question or something that you've been thinking about, maybe you're asking them questions about the connection here and they're not able to clearly answer you, or maybe they do answer, but deep down you know that there's more. That's the thing that's kind of throwing them off at this time. So while they may appear nonchalant on the surface, whatever it is that you're inquiring about is actually running on their minds over and over and over again. It's like the answer to all of those questions are literally hunting this masculine at this time. But for some reason, they're not budging. They, they're in this position where it's imperative for them to assume this, this kind of position of control over their emotions and over how you view them at this time. So if you're wondering what's going on with your person, um, 
mentally they're kind of scrambled okay their, their energy is coming through very kind of all over the place right now and this is mainly stemming from them trying to appear as if everything is casual but there's more going on and there's more to this connection than your person is willing to admit at this time okay so yeah this is a very a very interesting energy this may be very specific as well Let's get the next message here. Wow. Yeah, there's definitely something going on. The next message we have is ignore my actions. So immediately I'm getting that the way your person is presenting externally or the actions that they're showing you is vastly different from what's going on internally with them. Okay. So there's a vast difference between their emotions versus their actions. Honestly, I'm getting that this connection is a tough one for this masculine. And it actually has them in a state of confusion often. You have no idea, Divine Feminine, the range of emotions that this masculine feels when it comes to you. And they wish you knew just how much they ruminate over you and over this connection. And mainly because they view you as someone who has the ability to pull their strings. And I'm getting that you may know this already. You may know just how much this masculine feels for you. Because when you're around them or when you engage them, I'm getting that their energy tells on them all the time. So you can pay attention to their body language, the things that they say. I'm getting heavy attraction, heavy chemistry just the vibe of this connection also the eye contact their body language tells on them their energy tells on them but if they were to tell it they would claim that this is not happening but i'm getting that what makes this connection stand out to them is that this is someone who cannot stop coming towards you it kind of goes against everything that they say or what they're trying to say, and they feel as if their body kind of betrays them in this way. There's a serious magnetic pull that they feel towards you, and they can't figure out why or how this happens, but it does. And then it's like when they notice that it's happening, they immediately assume this position of control. It's like they're trying super hard to snap out of it. For some of you, this may actually, it may actually shock you just how much this masculine feels for you romantically. But what's sticking out here and what's being highlighted is that they know you feel their energy. So you may ask yourself often, why won't they just be forthcoming? Why won't they just state the obvious? Because I'm getting that this is a connection where the energy is, the chemistry, the energy, the intensity is off the charts. But your person is not saying anything or their actions are not adding up with what it is that you both are feeling. And this is someone, Divine Feminine, who you have deep feelings for, but you definitely feel like the way that they're presenting right now is complicating your connection. This is someone that you understand on a much deeper level, way beyond what they have openly expressed to you, okay? And there are many things that they don't necessarily have to say. You just get them. So you may already know this, you may have intuitively picked up on this, and it's like you still kind of allow this masculine to assume some type of control in how they engage you. But at this time, they're questioning themselves because this is definitely ego-based energy that they're in. But I feel like there's a natural flow here. There's something behind this. There's a natural flow that they're trying to establish with you. And you may not be aware of this, but you're actually teaching them a very valuable lesson about true love and connection. And that's, you know, the lesson here is that connection is something that should come naturally to you. And this is why they feel like you kind of pull on their strings here. There's a lot of energy coming through here because there's so much that hasn't been said, okay? It's like, there's a lot of information coming through here, okay? But this, this person feels like you pull on their strings because you make them get out of their head and drop down into their heart space without warning. And their natural response is like to try to go back into control mode here, 
but you have a way of shifting their energy without their permission. And this is something they're not used to, okay? You may even feel like this masculine is testing you at this time. There's a very testy kind of energy here that I'm feeling, but not in a way where they're trying to manipulate you. It's like they're actually trying to find their flow. There's something here about the things they say as well that, that keeps sticking out to me where you kind of have the ability to like decode their words and get right to the truth. And I'm picking up on a divine feminine that is very, very sharp mentally, where you know exactly what they're doing, okay? And what's interesting is that deep down, they want you to know why they're operating in this way, but they can't find the words to tell you. So if you're at this space right now where your person always seems to be thinking and trying to be logical about every single move that they make, they feel as if they're being forcefully, you know, strategic about everything or on the defense, they have deep feelings for you. And with you, they felt something so intense and so natural that they're kind of trying to force themselves into this energy of defense because this feeling of ease and flow is not natural to them. Although it should be, it's not. And there could be many, many reasons for this, but they're actively trying to find their flow. So Divine Feminine, I feel like what their actions are communicating to you is that they appreciate how you kind of already know this information, but you still have given them the room to find their natural flow. And you both, I'm getting this is a very, very organic connection. There's a natural flow here that I'm picking up on where you and this masculine have great chemistry. Like you work really, really well together. But you may feel like they always do something that makes the connection feel a little awkward. Or it's like you both express how you feel in some form, whether in action, communication, or energetic exchange. But they'll do this thing where they make you feel as if you're alone and feeling this way. They think that their actions, their body language, or just the things they say already give them away too much in this connection. And this is why they're coming through saying, ignore my actions, because they're clearly sending you in circles. It's like they're acknowledging this. And they feel really guilty about this. That's that energy that I was picking up in the beginning. And this guilt could be building at this time, because honestly, I don't think this is their natural response to you. I feel like this is something that they're doing, but they don't necessarily understand why they're doing it. And they know that it doesn't have anything to do with you, okay? Or the chemistry of this connection. So this may make you question yourself because of this energy that your person is creating. But they're coming through clearly saying, ignore my actions. Because right now, their actions are not a direct reflection of what they truly feel for you at this time and the value that this connection holds in their life, okay? That was a lot. I feel like this masculine may be repressing a lot of things, okay? And it's like they just want to clear the air and put it out there. So this energy, this kind of stagnant energy could definitely be lingering in your connection or could have been lingering in your connection for a while. It's kind of like they want to clear the air here. Let's get the next message. Wow. The next message we have is protecting my heart. Okay. So now, now it's beginning to come together here. If you're resonating with this message, I'm getting that this masculine has a certain way that they do things. There's a very adamant, firm energy coming through with this card here. And when it comes to relationships, your person has a way that they do certain things. Maybe they have a certain timeline. Maybe they have a certain way that they go into a connection. But I'm getting that they navigate every single connection the same. They walk in wanting to assume this position of defense as it pertains to their heart space, wanting to kind of protect their most prized possession. And they walked into this connection with you in the same way. But what I'm getting clearly here is that they didn't feel the need to kind of protect their heart with you. And that may be the reason why they're trying to kind of reinforce this defense mechanism in your connection because this didn't come naturally to them. Now they're trying to like overdo it or force it, but it's coming off as, you know, not really a natural reaction. And this is why you may be confused because they are honestly confused. 
This is someone who is at this place right now currently. This is current energy that I'm picking up on where they know or they've come to the realization that they actually don't have to do this with you. And what they're trying to figure out now is how can they operate in this connection without having to bring this kind of forceful energy into the connection. This, this is constantly playing on their minds over and over again. So you may be picking up on your energy. I'm getting divine feminine. You may feel very anxious because this is a connection where this could be a very pivotal point where things are moving, should naturally be moving to the next phase. But for some reason, your person has kind of maybe backtracked. Maybe they pulled their energy back here. They're ruminating a lot over the next stages of your connection here. And honestly, you know, this dynamic that they've created, you know, it just, it, it doesn't feel natural to them. They realize that they're going against the grain. So if you're wondering how your person is feeling, you definitely are at this place where, you know, you're moving to the next stages of your connection. And it's important for them at this time to kind of maintain this flow here. I'm getting a very organic connection where it kind of, you know, unfolded very, very naturally. And you both, this is very important to you, Divine Feminine, I'm getting. It's like they feel guilty because you're someone who appreciates a free-flowing connection where you are in your journey right now. That's very important to you. You're not into doing anything that's forced. You're not into overexertion. You're not into, you know, playing into these dynamics where you're operating in your, con in your connection from a position of lack. You have assumed, you know, a very, very healthy position. And I feel like you both went into it that way, but your person could definitely be at this place where they're backtracking a bit. And th this is why, okay? They went into every connection wanting to protect their heart. But with you, they didn't have to do that. And that kind of scared them a little bit because they're trying to figure out, well, you know, I usually come into the connection. I have everything planned out. By this time, we should be doing this, you know, very linear type of energy here. And so when they didn't have to, you know, put up this defense with you, it's like they're trying to forcefully put up some type of defense. They're trying to make it into something that it's not. This is a connection that does not feel natural to them. This dynamic, this free-flowing, high vibrational dynamic, okay, where they can just come in and be themselves and be authentic, it doesn't feel natural to them. It feels good, really, really good, but not natural. So they're trying to find their flow with you. It's like they want you to know that, you know, I tried to come into this thing protecting my heart space, but that didn't work. You definitely had their heart, Divine Feminine, in case you were wondering. Let's get the next message here. Wow, the next message we have is, please stop holding back from me. Yeah. There's a lot of mirroring in this connection. And I'm getting that you both are intuitive. This masculine energy is intuitive as well. Both of you are highly intuitive and you have the ability to read one another very well. And a lot of the times you both will let the other know how you feel by mirroring the energy. And your person's energy right now is coming through very up and down. They can definitely feel your frustration at this time. But what they don't realize is that you're acting as a mirror to them because they're holding back. So your natural response, Divine Feminine, will be to kind of pull back your energy as well. And this is where you may feel as if your person is playing this game because they're interrupting the natural flow of things by trying to control their expression and what they show you. And now this is spilling over into the connection in a way that they don't really like. So Divine Feminine, at the time, your energy is coming across very sharp. If you're wondering how your person is viewing you, Okay, they're, they're, they're paying attention to you closely. This is a masculine that trusts your judgment, whether you know it or not. So the fact that they can pick up on that you're pulling back a little bit is actually adding to this intensity that they feel emotionally. 
They really don't like this feeling at all. And they really don't have anyone to blame but themselves, okay? But this is something clearly that they don't want to exist. Or this is something that they don't want to become the norm in your connection. So I feel like you kind of both are, or you're actually showing them a mirror of their actions. You have their full attention and they want to change this. But they've realized that something that was so organic and free-flowing can quickly turn into a connection that's very cyclical and very stuffy, okay? And unpredictable in like a low vibrational kind of way. And they feel, this is someone who feels way too deeply for you to even let this manifest. So I feel like things have kind of taken a weird turn in the recent past where Divine Feminine, you maybe had to initiate this move of pulling back your energy purely as a response to your person. But they are aware of this. And they've been, they've been thinking about this over and over. I'm even getting that you may have asked them about this and they may have been very, very vague in their response. But the answer to the questions that you've been asking them is what brought them to this actual realization. And they're realizing that how they're operating in this connection could definitely manifest into a full-blown dynamic shift if they don't kind of course correct this. So yeah, they can definitely feel you pulling back your energy. They don't like this at all, okay? They wish that you would stop doing this, but I'm getting that you're acting as a mirror and you're actually showing your person how their energy is affecting the connection at this time and how this could actually affect the trajectory of, of the connection as well. Let's get the next message here. Wow, the next message we have is, I've made so many mistakes. <laughs> yeah, um, this is someone who is definitely going through a lot of emotions, working through a lot of things at this time, okay? But your person is having like a moment of truth as it pertains to their own emotional process. And this is not only about your connection, but other connections that they've been in as well. Like I said earlier, this is a masculine that approaches every single connection the same way. But this one with you is the one that stopped them in their tracks. You really have them thinking and even digging up things from the past about themselves. They're realizing that they are playing a major part in the delays of your connection, which is very confusing to them. Because if they could be 100% honest with you, this is someone who views you as a permanent person in their lives. If they haven't told you this already, this connection is very serious to them, Divine Feminine. And as they've been sitting back and thinking to themselves about you, they can really see themselves having a future with you. So at this time, they're actually thinking about how you view them. And if you want the same things that they want down the line, because underneath all of this, like emotions and, you know, all of this um, energy, this stagnant energy that's rising to the surface here, this is definitely someone who has been thinking about how to move your connection forward in the best way possible. So you may definitely see a huge shift in their energy. They have received a major reality check. It's almost as if your actions have helped them to see themselves better because of how they view you. This is someone who respects you and the place that you hold in their lives. And I feel like they're realizing they were playing themselves with this testy kind of energy. They're realizing it wasn't really necessary, especially since you have been open and really receptive since the beginning. So I feel like they wanna clear the air with you badly. They may be calling you to meet up or talk, you know, after a brief period of silence here. They may want to engage in something really lighthearted because honestly, they've already been carrying the bulk of their emotions on their sleeve recently. But you will definitely feel an energy shift very, very soon, okay, <laughs> with this masculine. Let's get the last message here. Yeah, I feel like this, this message may be very specific, okay? Wow. The last message we have is can't imagine losing you. Yeah. This is someone who has, in the recent past or just recently, 
realize that you are absolutely irreplaceable, Divine Feminine. If this masculine were to be 100% honest with you, they don't want to lose you. They don't want to even think about what that may feel like, what that may look like, <laughs> okay? And I'm getting that you have no idea how much they feel for you. I'm getting that this is a heavy, heavy attraction here with this person. Physical attraction, mental, emotional, spiritual, literally on every level. And this masculine thinks that you are sharp. There's something here about your mind, the way you communicate, the way you engage them. I'm getting that in your words and in your actions, but not in like an abrasive kind of way, but they view you as a very assertive feminine energy. You're the type of person to get what you want. <laughs> and they know this to be true because whatever wall they try to hold up with you, you got past that with ease, divine feminine. So now they're planning to do something that will impress you. They want to do something that will kind of catch you totally off guard. But they really just want to make you smile. There's like a really light energy coming through with this. They want to let you know that they appreciate you and this connection. And most importantly, how good it feels to them. And they don't want that. They really, really don't want that to change. So they may even actually tell you this verbatim, you know, about how they're feeling, about this connection, you know, about them trying to come in and control the direction of this, control their emotions, not really withhold things, simply because of the timeline and how quickly and organically things took off. You know, a lot of times masculine energy will have things set in their mind like, okay, I can't say I love you until this time. Or maybe they came into this connection feeling these, feeling these things instantly. And that kind of scared them a little bit and put them in this defense mode. Like, who is this feminine energy that, you know, has my heart literally in the palm of their hands, has my nose wide open? That, that's how you make them feel. They literally feel like you pull their strings and they feel like they don't have control as it pertains to their emotions, their body language, because I'm getting this as a masculine energy where their, their body language, their energy tells on them, even if their mouths are saying something or not saying something, the energy in this connection is very powerful, okay? So if you're currently wondering how your person is viewing you, they're actually more concerned with how you're viewing them at this time. Your opinion matters to them and how they are performing in this connection, according to you, is very important to them, okay? That's being highlighted. This is definitely a connection that will be long lasting. This masculine sees a solid future with you, Divine Feminine, and they're aiming to make you a more permanent part of their lives. But they also know that there's some there's some things they have to course correct, okay, in order for that to happen. So their energy may be a little up and down here because their emotions are definitely all over the place. But they're trying to establish their balance here so that you both can be in a happier place, okay? So this is definitely a connection where this energy may manifest in like a higher commitment. This could be moving in together, but they plan to do something that will immediately solidify this connection and also put your heart and mind at ease, Divine Feminine, because they see you as a very permanent part of their future, okay? This is beautiful energy. So I'm gonna go ahead and end the reading here. These are the messages that I have for you all today. If you resonated with this message, be sure to hit the like button on the way out and I will see you all in the next video. Bye, bye, bye.